Hey guys, this is Monster Ray, and I want to talk to you about internet censorship. Um, so to start, internet censorship is like the act of controlling or suppressing content on the web. So like, if you think back to the days of Mega Upload, they got super censored, like completely blocked and taken down, and all this stuff was given to the FBI. So yeah. Also. <laughs> These can be helpful or harmful if you think of pirating as, like, good for you, then, like, mega uploads getting taken down is bad for you, for your society, at least. But it's also helpful because think if, like, pornography was just all over the web, you'd be like, whoa, dude, I don't want my child on there. So, yeah, it, it helps and it harms. In the first place, uh, censorship has been going on for like decades. Like back when in the 50s when Elvis was around, he got censored because he was on this uh, famous television show. Uh, I don't know what it was, but it's it, it, what it was is it panned down and it only went to his torso and not any farther because his the pelvic movements he did for his like his dancing were deemed vulgar back then because their what they thought was normal was different than what we think is normal now and that's what I was going to say is even though inner censorship is good it doesn't mean it should happen because it's very hard for it not to frame us into what we think because in the society of its own, it's, it goes and makes its own ways of what's allowed and what's not allowed anymore. So if you go back to, like, go back to Elvis, would you think, like, seeing Elvis on a show, you'd be like, whoa, whoa, that's, uh, that's too much, put that away, censor that stuff up. No, you wouldn't, you wouldn't think that, because society's like, dude, he's got clothes on, I've, I've seen better, worse than that. But the problem is that censoring the internet could give the government more tools to frame what we think about. Like, who to pick for a, a campaign for who's running for president, or even like any other um, public figure, it could frame to what you want to think. Like, it could censor all of the other runners, and just leave you there and be like, Ha! I'm the only one who's running actually, and there's no one else. I swear. Yeah, but that's, that's not cool, because then they wouldn't have equal rights. Um, then also, they can like have it so telling people that a world without censorship is a world of chaos. And I'm not saying it isn't already, and I'm not saying that that's a bad thing, because chaos is interesting. It keeps the world fun. But like they could say that, and then the censorship would be able to continue on forever and continually be able to get like worse. It also breaches our first amendment which is f freedom of speech. We should be able to have our ideas flow and be heard by anyone. So if we're getting censored because of what we say then I don't have my freedom of speech you're censoring me and taking away my first amendment. That's that's not cool. Another way to look at it is at uh, China. They have their so-called uh, Great Firewall of China. That's tied in with their Great Wall of China. Um, it's a system <laughs> uh, a system where their, all their Cisco routers, they have Cisco analyze every packet of information that passes uh, in and out of the country and it searches for phrases or words that the government says I don't want those to be seen by my by my country this is a good thing for China because they can continually the, the way they, their government run which is a, a um, communist plan and that is helpful for them because they can they can keep their ways and have all their people happy if they aren't all happy I don't know but uh yeah it keeps it so they can do whatever they want and that's good for them so it may not be great for their citizens because they can't 
say whatever they want or look at whatever they want, like all of YouTube. But uh, yeah, that that that's a poor part of it. And I, I'm giving my uh, side of the whole point this entire time. But uh, I feel like they they should have internet censorship like a little, but everything has their little and lot and the perfect. You can't have no censorship and complete censorship. You gotta have just the right amount. Like censor all the all the bad obscene things, make them go away, and keep the good stuff. Like all of YouTube. Cause like some some countries like Egypt and China and some other countries around there, I think Brazil did, may or may not. I don't know. I'm smart, I swear. But yeah, keep all that good stuff and yeah, keep doing what you're doing. I'll see you guys next time. See you later. Oh, oh yeah, by the way, this is a project for my CMSD class for, for college.